for 2019 seems to be the season of the clowns with the release of it chapter 2 and the much awaited joker the fan response for both of these properties has been intense and they're surely going to set the box office on fire both it and joker are popular franchises and have a dedicated fan base that has existed for decades they both have been adapted on the big screen in the past as well to mixed results but their popularity hasn't dimmed in any way because we all have a thing for clowns. Come to think of it, it's ironic that something that's actual purpose is to bring joy and happiness could be a source of so many frights and nightmares. It makes the folks at Nerdytainment wonder. What is it about Joker and It, more commonly known as Pennywise the Clown, that makes them so much appealing to the audiences? Before we get to that, let's first click the subscribe button and hit that bell icon. Done? Alright, so let's stop clowning around and take an in-depth look at what makes both of these characters so scary. Number 1. Origins Wanna know how I got these cars? One of the reasons Heath Ledger's portrayal of the Joker got so much popularity was because there was an element of mystery attached to the character. He had no origin story. All we knew was that he was hellbent on spreading chaos and upsetting the established order. He just wanted to see the world burn and that made him even more frightening. According to him, he was just showing people their true faces, kind of like how fools used to do in the King's Court. Alan Moore indeed gave the character an origin story with the killing joke, and the upcoming movie also seems to be going in that direction. But the Joker's greatest strength lies in the mysterious origin story. Pennywise is no different. Well, actually he is. See, unlike the Joker, Pennywise isn't a human. He is a prehistoric entity that has been around since the dawn of mankind. This entity isn't just content with killing kids after every 27 years, no. It has the entire town of Derry under its control. Simply put, kids had Pennywise to blame if their parents grounded them. Number 2. Evil Personified When it comes to the Joker and Pennywise, there are no shades of grey. Both of these characters are evil personified and this is one of the reasons for their popularity. Pennywise the Clown is a twisted demonic entity that feasts on helpless kids. In its own words, children's meat is the tastiest and fair is like seasoning that makes it tastier. And you thought Hannibal Lecter with his Chianti's was bad. The Joker is not so far behind himself. As seen in the comics, the Clown Prince of Crime has no hesitation in murdering kids himself. Who could forget his vicious beatdown of Jason Todd, the second Robin? Now, don't get us wrong, we aren't exactly the biggest fans of Robin either, but we can all agree that even he didn't deserve what he got. Adding to that is the fact that this isn't even the worst thing that the Joker has done, and you can see what makes him one of the greatest villains of all time. Number 3. The John Wayne Gacy Connection The Killer Clown isn't just a trope that exists solely in films and books, it's based in reality. Both the Joker and Pennywise have been in some way or the other inspired by the real-life serial killer John Wayne Gacy. A serial killer on the loose is scary enough on its own and what made Gacy even scarier was, you guessed it, his calling card, the clown costume. That's right folks, one of America's most dangerous mass murderers used to dress up as a clown. Gacy under the guise of Pogo the Clown murdered 33 men from 1972 to 1978. For his action, he was given the moniker Killer Clown. We don't need to guess how that connects with Pennywise and the Joker. Just like Pennywise, Gacy used to lure his victims before assaulting them. He too was a victim of abuse, something that has been hinted in the Joker's origin story. And like the clown prince of crime, Gacy expressed no regrets over his actions. He instead blamed it on external circumstances. You know, that one bad day. Number 4. Chordophobia In addition to Gacy, the killer clown trope is also rooted in the realm of psychology. A lot of us don't know this, but there is a psychological disorder which is known as chordophobia. In simple terms, this phobia is known as the fear of clowns. The jury is still out regarding the reason for this phobia. However, one thing is for sure, characters like Pennywise and the Joker have a lot to do with this condition. Psychologists and experts agree that media portrayals along with the mask and costume designs are some of the factors that cause this phobia. Come to think of it, that's what makes these two characters such great villains. They don't just do hideous things on screen or on paper, they are messing up our real lives as well. Talk about being meta. Still excited for it chapter 2 and Joker? Tell the folks at Nerdytainment what you expect from both of these films. Also like, share and subscribe for more.